Tommy was at the local park with his family when a colourful poster caught his eye. It advertised a hot air balloon festival happening the next weekend. Tommy's excitement soared as high as the balloons on the poster. He begged his parents to go and they agreed, making plans for the adventure. At the festival, Tommy and his family met Mr Baxter, the balloon pilot, who offered to teach Tommy about the balloon. He explained how the balloon worked, showing Tommy the burner, basket and colourful envelope. Tommy was fascinated and eagerly helped with the preparations. The day of the ride arrived and Tommy could barely contain his excitement. As the balloon slowly filled with hot air and began to rise, Tommy's heart raced. With a gentle whoosh, they were lifting off, the ground falling away beneath them. Floating above the town, Tommy was amazed by the bird's eye view. Everything looked so different from up high. Mr Baxter pointed out landmarks and shared stories of his travels. Tommy felt like he was part of a special secret club of adventurers. As they drifted calmly, a sudden small shadow flitted into the basket. A curious sparrow. It hopped around, pecking at the basket before settling down. Tommy gently offered it a crumb, and the bird pecked it from his hand, adding an extra bit of magic to the journey. After a few hours, it was time to return. Mr Baxter expertly guided the balloon to a gentle landing in a soft field. The ground crew rushed over to help secure the balloon. Tommy felt a mix of sadness that the ride was over and excitement from his incredible experience. Back on solid ground, Tommy couldn't stop talking about his adventure. At school the next day, he shared his experience with his classmates and wrote a story about it, which his teacher proudly displayed on the classroom wall. That night, Tommy dreamt of soaring in hot air balloons over different landscapes around the world. He knew this was just the beginning of his adventures. Someday, he thought, he'd pilot his own balloon. Join Tommy as he takes to the skies in more high-flying adventures. What will he discover next as he explores the world from above?